Okay, this is a CS dark light uh, that took six months um, hard work, um, research, and what I've got down there at 25 yards away is a target, and I've got a laser bore sighter connected. And there's a lot of skeptical people. So let's see if I can show you the screen. You can see the laser just between the two lower targets and you can see the reticle on the plugged in there and uh, you can see it on the screen uh, you can see the reticle from the CS dark light actually uh, on the target now a lot of people were skeptic thinking that no you cannot it's impossible to get a camera in there and adjust the turrets or the dials some people call it elevation and and uh, windage turrets so I'm going to just prove this just by showing you by turning let's keep the light out of the camera just turning the elevation to bring it down and as you can see it's just brought it down and then I'm going to turn the windage I'll get it the right way and as you can see a laser dot yeah, there you go the laser dot is now centered direct smack bang let's uh, bring the rifle there you go oh it's just disappeared slightly because uh, the laser doesn't reflect off the uh, off the target that way. Let's bring it into a dark area. There we go. There you can see. Now just to prove it again. Sorry about the backlight. If I move, adjust the elevation again. You can see. There you go. The laser on the screen. You can see comes out of line. Elevation back again. Oh, and I moved. It's quite difficult to do this. Let's move it over. And there you go. You can see elevation going out. And back in again. It's quite difficult to get, keep the rifle still while doing this. And I've got a lot of backlight as well. But there you can see the laser is now directly in the centre uh, using the turrets and I'll be videoing this as well through the viewfinder and don't think I'm going to be able to get a good picture through there no because I've got too much backlight no I've got too much backlight uh, let's um, stop that a second okay as it's got a bit darker now and the sun's uh, a little bit lower in the sky I won't um, have too much backlight on the screen now so you can really really see the laser quite well um, let's see if I can set the uh, scope up a little bit better okay now that the sun's gone in a little bit I thought I'd uh, show you how well the scope works with the uh, elevation and the windage dials just show you now uh, I'm moving the elevation down down to meet the crosshair there you go perfectly in the middle okay just to prove that the windage works as well there you go, moving the scope sights off the target and then back on there you go